Hey guys, this is Harsh from shoutmeloud.com and in this video I'm going to show you how you can find uh, how which website is penalized by Panda or not. So if you have a website that you are going planning to buy or uh, you want to just study about that blog that is if it's ranking high or not or if it's penalized by Panda or not, this is the best tool to research that. So let me quickly going to show you how you gonna find out. So once you're inside your SEMrush dashboard, click on position changes. And once you're inside that, just uh, enter the domain name. So let me quickly going to take an example of, uh, let's say, mashable.com and click on search. So this new and lost keyword will show you uh, how many keyword ranking they lost and how many keyword ranking they gained over the time. So uh, from so it shows the ranking for last one year. So in, you can see in April 2002, well, Marshall.com got ranking for better ranking for one lakh sixteen thousand keyword, and at the same time they lost ranking for one lakh fifteen thousand keyword. So that's more or less the even. And this is for the recent one where you could see it's one lakh fifty one thousand for the new keyword, the improvement in the ranking, and at, at the same time one lakh twenty six thousand. Uh, ranking went down. Another way to look into that is just go to smrush.com, type marshable.com uh, and you could see the graph and that will actually give you an overview like how marshable.com is doing over the time. So uh, we know like the first Panda roll, global rollout happened in March 2011. So this is where Mashable was when the Panda rolled out, so they didn't get got affected anyhow. And then uh, there was a slight drop increment, and right now uh, in the recent update they got decrement, which is not much compared to the first Panda rollout. And that's one of the reason they are an authority authority website. But at the same time, you could uh, use this research tool for any website that you want to. Uh, research for especially for your competitor website so that's one way to look into it then there are another tool called penguintool.com and many more so you could look into the description for more explanation and a link to try out SEMrush for 14 days for completely free if you still have any question feel free to ask me via comments thank you for asking this is Harsh